hey, 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 what is up? What is up? Beautiful, beautiful people. Send in some love and positivity in your direction. Thank you so much for joining me for a little Zero to Hero. The Long Way Home Tour Play Series. Welcome, Barry B. And Barry B. The legendary Purple Berry, of course. And the second account. Look at that. Two thumbs up for the price of one. Be like Barry, boys. What's up, Edward? Thank you, bro. Nice to see you, buddy. Welcome, Tuck. Thank you, bro. Good morning to you. Hope you're having a good day. Mr. Brandon Dunham is in the house. Welcome. Welcome, guys. How's the tournament going? How, how did it go? Excuse me. I should say I never really looked back through. I didn't even like get my like pop up and chest thing. It just kind of like, I don't know. It didn't happen. So I don't even know how I actually finished. Welcome, Nick Holly. Welcome, bro. Thank you very, very much. Appreciate you, buddy. Nice to see you. Hope you guys are having a good day. Why? Yeah, in the house. Welcome, bull. Thanks, you guys. Nice to see you. Yeah. What was it called? All star. I don't even know. It would have been pretty low wasn't amazing i don't even know i just never saw it so what can i say i'm a noob who doesn't even know how he did but yet he's gonna keep doing it with the north north carolina coming up soon welcome jeffrey bowman nicely played john 34 under bro i feel like he got ripped off a bit but that's still a very 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 nice round well played buddy get some booms in the chat hey what's up david Medlio? Ooh, let's go Brandon Mucker. I don't even know what that really means. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready, ready, ready. So I did I tell you guys that I did officially. I did tell you, but you might not have seen the post. Um, I'll play expert. Um, not in the nine hole. I'm going to keep making notes. I have a lot of fun with that. What's up, Jules? But I'm going to try some expert tournaments for a bit. Go see how that goes. I did mention that I would do so. So I feel like that would be, you know pretty good thing to follow through on how about tailwind on the first hole right i know this is like the worst hole well we got my wish anyway how's the day how's everybody doing what's up it's been uh it's been a nice day for me i can't complain it was a family day here in canada happy president's day uh down in the u.s of a um otherwise it was nice you know nice nice uh no traffic I got good parking today. Welcome, Nick Casey. Very, very well, buddy. Welcome in. Welcome in, all you beautiful people. So, yeah, I figured we'll play our uh, play a little tour play tonight. This guy's going to go in the rough here, I think. Yeah, always going to try to get it up there. Oh, he just about did. Nice, Jules. I'm down. I'm down. I mean, bro, this is a tr trashy hole. I get why you're going to try to go. I mean, I guess I probably should, too, with this club. Let's try. I think I max no P no push up here would get us there. A little bit of right curl. Pretty much all the right curl this club has to offer. No guts, no glory. All in good fun. Come on. First order of business, hit the fairway good. Second, get that roll. Slow down. Slow. Oh, you son of a. <laughs> Expert. No, Nick. No, not at all. No, I'm going to play the. Uh, I'm going to play the, the nine hole the same way. Uh, I'll probably won't play it on this account. Because, uh, well, I might. It just depends where I have the gems. Welcome here, Jeff. Welcome in, bro. I'm not going to try to make any expert notes. That's just not for me right now. Maybe after I play some tournaments for a few months and I'm feeling good, then yeah, maybe we could do that together. But I feel like for me, it'll be a good, like, kind of a mix between, like, you know, providing some tangible value to people and having some notes. Hey, mad welcome, bro. Honestly, I don't even know. Is that ridiculous? I don't even remember seeing the thing. Jeffrey Bowman, bro. 20 baby thank you so much man thank you so much i have to look i don't really know what the like the the icon of it looks like so scrolling through them all it's not exactly very compelling content if you know what i mean i'm guessing in like the 20s you know what i mean like somewhere in the 20s all right it's fine 
I'm not going to chip that one in to win, unfortunately. I put it in the water. Life goes on. I just didn't know it would carry quite that much. Just, I just thought the rough would slow it up. Um, I'm in mountain time. Current time for me is 0105. Okay, let's not do that again. Checkpoint. Go away. I'm not against the checkpoint challenge. I wonder how it's different this time. I should at least look at the... Uh, I just want to see the... Um, like the progression for it. Uh, oh, yeah. So one, two, 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 and then three. I think that makes sense. They did that before. I know they've tweaked that uh, a few times along the way, which I think is good. Well, I don't really think our time zone matters, bro. Definitely... Uh, I have no idea what tier I'm in. I don't know. One top 20, other 8th. Nice. Nice. Yeah, I've played Expert before. It's not like a brand new thing. Um, I had way less um, coins the last time I did. It was literally one of the main reasons I stopped playing it. I went back to Pro because I wasn't really playing any tour play at the time. Oh, I don't think so, David. Hey, how you doing, Willow? Okay, I guess we're going to have to look and find out. I need to see what the uh, the cheerleaders. Well, I can actually. We still have that. Uh, we still have that slideshow running. Breakpoint challenge. Window. Nice. That's crazy, dude. All right. Keep an eye on my friend here. Ten T's. I don't really know what the All Star Tournament logo looks like. Is the problem? I know I didn't get a banner. That's some mansion one. Oh, you know what I'll do? I'll look at... I know a couple people that sent me their results. And then if I can just see what it looks like, then I can find it real quick. Or quicker. So I want to know now, too. I really don't even know. It's like the game, like, glitched and didn't give me, uh... The little finishing thing. Oh, okay. It looks like a little basketball doodad. All right. Not time zone, doesn't matter. That's Englishy. Okay. 37th place. There you go. Thanks, bro. Nick is on it. 37th place with minus 30. So, yeah, it wasn't my best round. It wasn't super terrible. It was, it was fun. You know, I really enjoyed those courses. And, you know, I would uh, I would do it again. In fact, I, I will. Is <laughs> that? Okay, I'm just going to try to play this kind of little bit of half ball curl here. Just try to keep it safe. I don't really know. This is an old course, but I've never liked it. Thanks, Nick. Yeah, I didn't think to look on the clan list either. That would have been smart. But you have the benefit of third-party perspective right now, which is very, very helpful. I do appreciate it. There's something I can't really explain. I can't articulate um about the mindset of when you're live streaming there's like just something that happens in my head yeah i'm not a big fan either but i'm having fun and i definitely don't like want you guys to feel like you know you have to come here and match up and tour play it's uh it's, it's kind of like it's difficult it's difficult he's a titan i am I'm just using Tommy's notes. So that's the recommended club uh, ball, excuse me. And then the club is the Thor's, the Sniper, the Grizzly. Okay, I knew the elevation here uh, is higher. So let's try like 30 something. I think I'm just about as close as he was. Maybe a bit better actually. 12, 2. Yeah, a bit better. Got a bit to work with here. 16, 2, I think will be reasonable. I'm going to push. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, that's right, Jules. That's that third party perspective again. None, Matt. No, bro. They don't give a shit about me. They don't care one bit that I exist. Uh, they literally don't care. I, I do believe I provide a reasonable 
you know, um, promotion for the game, right? Like, um, one time, three years ago, there was a community manager from Golf Clash, uh, and that was when Tommy was sponsored years ago, and he connected me with a guy. Uh, welcome, Jeremy Seal. Thank you, bro. Uh, so I talked to him off and on. We talked back and forth quite a bit. Hey, Dunner. Welcome, bro. Party on, Garth. Thanks for being here, bro. And um, yeah, they did actually feature one of my rookie walkthrough videos in the in-game hub one time. Nice, Nick. Yeah, well, there's two spots open in Airlick Gaming right now. So if you want to do anything, it's cool by me. Um, but I'm also... Yeah, I just want you guys to be happy with that. I know one of our members went to go and help out Mr. Rock. He's got a little push going on. And I'm a pretty low-key kind of clan. I'd love us to be, like, always competitive Master 3 kind of thing. Okay, let's look at the shootout. But I really just... I just want us to enjoy each other's company, treat each other well, have a nice, positive, happy, friendly clan that you can, you know, be proud of and not have to stress about. So Tailwind, we're going to be Sniper P3 Max. Bullseye should be just by the edge of the bunker. Okay, I'm going to play 20% Max here. 5.5 back, one right, and then outer wall right curl. Hey, Jesse Hundley, welcome, bro! No, that's good, bro. It's good. I'm happy if we do play together. 40? Uh, 20 here. The last hole might have been 40. The last shot was pretty okay. Right, Jules? Yeah, there's like no sweat. It's all it's all good. It's just a friendly, friendly group. Nice, Matt. That's good, bro. There's no shame in that, bro. Heck, we get a big boom for beating Tommy. I mean, Tommy would compliment you as well. He's... Tommy's a pretty friendly, gracious guy. People like to shit on him on on Facebook because that's, you know, how awesome people are. But Tommy's cool, man. If you got questions about Golf Clash or whatever, he'll, he'll talk to you, help you out. 5.5 back. Twenty max. 16.3. Just a tiny little pull, push here. Some practice for expert. Make some bigger. And then outer wall, right curl. Okay, nice, perfect. Away. I don't know, Willow. It's fine. It's, it's fine. You know, it's it's the internet. Everybody's entitled to a little toxicity from time to time. It's okay. Nah, Jesse. Nah, we're good, bro. It's totally good. I know. I know you and your good heart, bro. I know that you are a man of the people and you have definitely been a kind and patient and generous and wonderful supporter and friend of this stream so one little match of golf clash there is never going to be any hard feelings there brother no matter the circumstances welcome in mr paul mcfadden good morning bro thank you very much good luck to you too if you're doing any playing any gaming having a good time Good. So I screwed up the first hole just by messing up the drive really badly. We've redeemed ourselves. Let's just keep on redeeming along the way here. That should give us a yeah, a little chest. I like the chest. Uh, that's Mark Cuban's team, right? Now I see why 20%. Not having Tommy's notes, I always play. Oh, okay. Yeah, like a hole like that, having his nose is so massively helpful for me. I'll take a big topper. Anytime you get something you don't have, right? Hey, Eacher! Welcome, bro! Thank you for being here, man. Thank you for the kind, kind words at the end of the last tournament. I do appreciate you, man. I knew he wasn't live, but still made, made me nervous as hell to eat. <laughs> right, Mary? I've literally been like playing friendly golf clash with Tommy on the stream and he's like got my back. He's trying to help me with every shot. And I'm just like, I'm just vibrating. <laughs> you know, like I just like look up to him, you know, welcome Grenson. Thank you for being here. And even though he treats me as a complete equal has always just been a chill guy, 
friendly you know we've talked about parenting stuff for crying out loud and still you know i don't know matt you missed the poll last stream you know it jules that's the right way buddy it's all in good fun it's just a game it's good to be busy you know it's good to be now i understand an apoc but i'm literally just gonna give this the layup effort here i'm hoping oh all these stupid hills i remember when i first started though like if the screen had glitched out like that i wouldn't even have been able to like turn around and recover and now i almost still have half the shot timer left oh a little great there should be fine into the wind i hope oh yeah Oh, I could have gotten a lot more. That's fine. That's actually... Uh, just that we had a poll between what was hotter, the NFL or the NBA NBA cheerleaders. Hey, what's up, Sam? How you doing, brother? Thank you so much for being here. Thank you all very much for taking some time to join this beautiful group of people. Uh, I would, David, if I wasn't playing with the Thors because of the fact a lot of these shootout shots are all based on that. So that was my rationale there. I might be in, no, I think I'll be in the long iron range. Late mail in ballot, right? I mean, I, I, I'm not picky. I'm all about consenting adults, having fun doing consenting adult things, whatever that might be. No, it's all good, E-Charm. Thank you for being here. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up. That's all I ask. Free and easy support. And have a good time. Spread a little, truly, some love to your community, to your friends, to your family. Whatever that might mean in your life. Do that for me. There's enough bullshit hate out there. All around in so many ways. We'll pull 17 rings. Just hope I hit the rough. I just have to hit the rough to be happy here. But this doesn't have to drop. Is this the next tournament? No, this is tour 10. Okay, I need a more even, but that's fine. My TikTok FYP. Mine hasn't. I got I got doubled down on the bongies. Hey Sam, bro! Thank you so much, man. From the Radu gang, give you greetings and good luck and mini pro. Thank you, bro. Thank you very, very much. I'll be uh I'll be playing pro in the nine hole, making notes, nothing will change. And then it'll be kind of sad. I'll be using different notes for the regular tournament. Welcome, Asco! What's up, buddy? Welcome in, man. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, thank you, Sam. That's the way. Look at the booms and the love in the chat. These guys, come on, why you gotta make me wait, bro? It's fine. I will take a, a dub. I need the coins. We're gonna have to spend them. I'm gonna check for jewels and for me and for y'all, which expert bracket I'm in. I, I'm in. I'm guessing it'll be hopefully tier two. Like tier one would be the dream, but I'm pretty sure that's not gonna be the case. Risky buddy, how you been? How you been? I think that was the euphemism certain gentlemen were using last week, Jeff. Yes. The uh, teeth equals tits. I'll just clarify it for you in simple terminology there. Um, <laughs> that's, that's, and it's ironic enough that my dad used to always say that to me to me and my stepbrother. You know, we'd be walking or whatever, but like, oh, look at her teeth. You know, he would always say that. So. <laughs> yes, who I am. Yes, absolutely absolutely i was kind of stressing on the whole like patreon situation but it was actually really fine i went to the web page and i just like switched my plan and it didn't even charge me and i was able to download expert notes immediately like i could have switched halfway through the tournament i think it just sticks to the same billing cycle you know so as long as you're a customer and you're on a billing cycle you can change your product as long as the value is equivalent um, obviously, if I chosen a higher value Patreon product, then I would have probably been charged the difference and then maintained my billing cycle. Is what I'm thinking how it works. Hey, welcome, Rancho. 
I know. I'm sorry. I don't even know. Here, here. Let me, let me just fix. Uh, I'll, I'll just fix the stream for you guys real quick here. There we go. There. Okay. That'll work. Let's play the next soul. Hi. <laughs> and I mean, you already know what tour we're playing. We already know what tour you're playing. Practice. Thank you, Nick. And if you haven't seen this logo before, well, you better subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Yay! Hi. I'm a man. The people. For the boys. <laughs> I'm just kidding too. But we can we can realign a little slightly here. I'm all about changing it around anyway. Oh. Stand by. Of course when I start playing around. Never really a good idea. There, that's fine for now. Hey, come here, Tour 10. Get your butt over here. It's fine. We're leaving it. There you go, Willow. Yeah, you know. Hey, welcome, Andy boy. Nice to see you, buddy. No, I'm good, Jules. I'll behave. I'm a good boy. I actually get complimented by respectable ladies all the time in my, my nursing ability to provide... Um, privacy and respect and dignity uh, you know it's not easy to have to be vulnerable especially in front of a strange man um, but I have my methods to you know maintain a person's dignity uh, and for some reason many typically a bit older than me anyway generation tend to think that that's not possible until they realize like we're just here to help you not to you know Put you out the hallway and expose you to every patient. Like, just here to help. Six point nine. So yeah, easy. I'm gonna just push you to max. Except I don't like how my latest subscriber. Where do I have that element? I think it might be my webcam. Oh, yeah, that's why. Recent. Here we go. And then latest super chat. I just want those generous and supportive individuals to have that little recognition. Okay, I don't even know what my ball did, but I think I have a sniper rough bump from here. Uh, it's like I don't know if I needed to push up there with that tailwind, but. Oh no! Oh! One of women's most favorite men, nurses, they say, here, put this in your mouth. <laughs> I don't know, David, apparently not enough. I gave it too much. I should have just played it like 10% max, would have been a fine. Negative 15. All right, well. <clears throat> I don't know that. 60. All right, well, I didn't think it was that far uphill. Okay, okay. Thanks for telling me ahead of time. 
Okay, so wait till I put it in the sand and then you're like, bro, let me tell you how it is. <laughs> I don't know. That's how I learn. I don't play that much. That's the problem, right? That's the, uh, that's where the struggle comes in. But this will be close enough here. Should be able to just get some perfect action. like that mm, 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 mm. dunk it no <laughs> mm, 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 mm. we're good get in the hole get in the hole this guy will probably drop his as well oh yeah he's got a little end bringer i forgot that he's in the short stuff can't go wrong here he doesn't even have to try just throw it through the hole good it's fine Hey, what's up, Rage? Welcome in, buddy. I got my uh, Red Dead stream coming up this week. Uh, Saturday night for me. But check the channel if you want to come on by for something a little different. Okay. Good. I'm glad I'm not going first. Most direct headwind, 10% min. C3 min, okay. Going very, very well. I can't complain. <laughs> 60 subs. Okay. Oh, I understand. I should have just played it more uphill. Even if I'd played it at my 80% slider, which is more my true club distance there, if I'd had. Um, I appreciate it, Rage. Yeah, uh, I, I would have been fine. I just played it too much downhill, not uphill. Oh. Oh, that blue point four, and then what do you say? Outer wall. I think that'll be okay. Yeah, bring it down the hammer. Play driver. Yeah, that worked out well. I followed the note to a T, and we're both screwed. Oh, push up one ring. <laughs> I didn't push up. Oh. Hey. I only did that because you're taunting me. We both screwed up. Um, I'm about 20 hours in, Matt. Uh, otherwise, the shot would have been good there if I'd pushed up one ring. Min 10%. Seven back, two right at the uh, the min line there. So yeah, 10% min. I forgot the push up. Yeah, I'm about 20 hours in. I don't have a ton of time to play. So like, um, like uh, throughout the week, right? So I figured if I took advantage... And so then every second Saturday, I'm going to do like a little variety type stream. I did read it. I just forgot about it. So I'll do Red Dead this week. And then two weeks from now, I'll, I'm going to play Fortnite. Two weeks after that, I'm going to play Warzone. And then every second week, I'm going to rotate between those three games for a little bit. It's only a couple sessions each. And then, you know, maybe I'll play one more than the others. I know that... Um, you know, some are more team group fun oriented, like, you know, Fortnite, we can, many of us can get in there. Um, whereas like, uh, you know, Red Dead is more like me just kind of playing and hanging out with you guys, which is, you know, it's a beautiful game. I should be able to stream. I got to test it. I haven't done that yet. If I can stream it at 4K, I have all my settings at 4K Ultra. It looks beautiful. I, I think at least, you know, check it out. The game like that is fun. But I'd like to play some games with you guys, too. That's where I think the Fortnite and Warzone, uh, for those who indulge. And, like, thank you to people like, you know, Bun and Jeffrey and Rachel and Shivaji for bringing different games to our community and making them, you know, give them, giving them some 
So giving us some variety. Steven D, welcome, buddy. Thank you so much. If you're here for a quickie, stick your thumb in it, would you? Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Oh, really, Paul? What the heck, man? Doesn't even make any sense. Mizzy Mike, welcome, bro. Thank you, buddy. Oh, don't do that, dude. You only need a couple bars of topspin here. Thank you, Steven. Appreciate it, buddy. All right, what are we doing? Just a simple bounce here. Yeah, I'm not, I don't need to be aggressive. We'll play this at mid. Uh, in the wind, I'll play three top. And a little hair of left spin just to be down the middle. So six, four. Uh, but at. I'm just going to play six rings here. Perfect. Let's be the fairway. Clean. Dead center. Could have got another two bars of topspin, but I'm just trying to be safe after my opponent already put it in the dirt. I don't need to go stupid. Now, this one is usually like zero or something. Hey, we should more productively talk about things like elevation prior to the shot. I'm just, I, I mean, I know it's, it's crazy. I should know these holes by now, but like maybe even like negative something in the wind. I don't know. Bum, bum. It's always a bit sketchy coming out of here anyway, landing on this hill. Bum, bum, bum. Zero. Okay, I get, look at, I did it right. Are you proud of me? <laughs> Should be pretty close anyway. And David, bro, I was actually looking at like uh, a video. Okay, five. I'll try five. I was playing a video like maybe three or four years old, and you were like the only one who commented on it. And uh, I was like, damn, man, like time goes so fast. Thank you all the support just a cool community eyeball it is short and left maybe yours bro mine thick and to the right i needed way more bum, bum, bum. more like plus five at that position anyway it doesn't matter we're safely on ready for the shootout focused up <laughs> thanks david it's all in good fun I sent a recommendation to golf clutch but they haven't responded it would be cool to have a mall shop for oh we've talked about that for years bro years and years and years we've talked about being able to buy a ball anytime you need it like imagine here i am this guy going into expert and i haven't played in it for a while and the new tournament comes out and it's like hey yeah i should get some of those such and such a stat ball i'm ready to spend some money shit i got 50 bucks baby come on i'm going in and then it's like oh sorry nothing for you to spend your money on well then three days go by and you know, i went and had some fun or did something or whatever and you know, by then you're not as willing to make that purchase. So, thanks, Stephen. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. I also have a pro um, video for you, buddy. If you want to check that out, this is slightly like so 20 min. It's like six back to right with the Thors. I don't blame you, Willow. I don't know why mine's going so quickly. It'd be cool to see your club stats. I'm not sure quite what you mean, Dunner. In what context? Like in one of my videos or in one of the... Like in the game? Oh, bro. Come on, buddy. You're insane, bro. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Get some love in the chat. Paul McBadden. Unbelievable. Rancho and Alan Risky. Rodney and Luca. Take care, Matt. Much love, bro. Thank you for being here, man. All right, we got this. Come on. Six back to right. Inner wall, right curl. Okay, between inner and outer wall with this wind, okay? Let's go 10.7. It's kind of in between angles.
I don't know. As long as it gets down there. Yeah, I agree, Willow. Thanks, guys. Get some love in the chat for Mr. Paul. Thank you, man. Sit, 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 sit. I don't really know where my opponent is, so just be closer. Sit, 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 sit. Sit, 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 sit. Okay, I should have gone the 6.5, but the other choice was 5.6, so that could have been worse. How'd I do? Oh, yeah, we did great. We did great. If you play different accounts, different club stats. Well, you sure can if you use an app like this. Like, I can just hop onto my other account, and now I know, like, what clubs I have anyway. But the other stuff, yeah, not so much. I'm just trying to visualize that like in a developed like product in the game, Dunner, because I think it's got a good bit of merit. But I'm trying to like visualize like how we would implement it in like the golf class, the play demic style. I thought you could check them in game. I think he means something a little more. Thank you, Bull. Thank you very much, man. Appreciate your generosity. There's no other way to put it. You are, like, you know, incredible. Boosting this community, boosting up me and my family. Uh, we appreciate you. Thank you very much. Um, you might be interested to know that uh, currently um, my personal discretionary funding is going towards my 13-year-old. Uh, I'm going to get him a decent little laptop. He's using a little 13-inch Chromebook currently, and I'm sitting there watching this like 100% math kid, 97 in science. Like he's got a 90 plus something, 95 in English and social. He's the smartest kid in his whole grade. And I was like, I got to get that kid a damn nice little computer. He deserves it. What's up, Dom Arthur? So yeah, anything from YouTube um, and such and such. I'm not going crazy. I want him to not get it stolen at school either. Um, but something along the lines, I was looking, um, my employer has a contract or like a, you know, arrangement with Dell. So I got the employee purchase program and get a good deal for them. Thank you, Tom. So yeah, in case you guys are wondering, like, man, what is this guy doing? Um, I got four kids. I'm not out there, you know, picking up, uh, just wasting, you know. I got plans. My YouTube, my situation's really comfortable, really awesome. Like, I'm very thankful. And uh, I just want to, you know, give you some insight into what this dad of four does. With such incredible generosity 6.4 so i was looking at like a you know like an inspiron or some sort of like maybe even like the dell g series that has a little graphics card in it for him so he can take it to his cousin's house in the summer and you know make it a useful device more than just a chromebook which now i've learned or you know they're good for the younger kids but they're they're kind of trashy little devices What do you guys think? Do you think that's a reasonable thing to do for like a super A plus student kid to kind of give him a little, you know, motivating factor? <laughs> I guess Edward agrees. Thank you, bro. Ben appreciates it, buddy. Thank you very much. Some love in the chat for Edward McCutcheon. Yeah, I just, you know, he's uh, he, he's the kind of kid that never asks for anything. When my wife is working, him and my older, him and my second son, they're always helping me with our younger siblings. You know, Ben, oh, he shovels the driveway all the time with the snow. He's always helping out, being a good kid. So I really want to kind of let him know that, like, we uh, appreciate him as parents. And that good behavior and strong academic standing deserves to be rewarded in my home. Oh, man, look. at It's a good win, though. I mean, I can't complain. We're going to have to max off. I'm going to slow needle... Max OP, we'll take that side spin off. Might even go up. That's the hair. 12, 5, 14, 1. Maybe we should push up two rings. Just a little bit. Oh, let's go. Steven D, baby. What are you doing, bro? Thank you very, very, very much. Oh, bro, I didn't mean to, like, this is not a cry. Bro, thank you very much. Get some love in the chat for these generous, beautiful people. No, we're, we're good. We're, we're cruising along. I really appreciate it, man. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ria D. Thank you, buddy. Man, thank you so much. Yeah, like, he, 
you guys are incredible thank you very much no you you seriously that's beyond above and beyond seriously thank you very kindly yeah he's yeah i can't complain i'm a very 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 blessed man five percent you reckon hey yeah get some love in the chat for these legends oh no that's the rough bump you think five percent okay okay the endbringer seven are you sure positive i believe you rancho at least the wind is pretty straight so that's helpful i'll try to shove that ball guide quite aggressively through the hole No. Oh. Some white welcome, bro. 15. Yeah, I would have thought so. But I don't think I think Oh, hey, what's up, Jim? I think that rewarding a child for great behavior and excellent work is a much more valuable thing to do for them than promise them something if they show the behavior you want. Thank you, Jim. Thank you. Yeah, he he never asks for anything. He he doesn't even he says he doesn't need it. I disagree. I just see him sitting there just tolerating, you know? And he's like, he's just focused. He's always typing. He brings it to the kitchen table. He's always, always typing and doing stuff. And he's sitting at the table or the desk and he's like hanging around the family, but he's got work to do, you know? And it's, uh, yeah. So, and, and I just see myself in him. And I remember, um, thank you very much, Nick. Thank you so much, bro. Yeah, the runner, right? It's me. And yeah, my mom was always like that. You know, she'd always be like, is there anything you need at school? You know, do, do, do you feel cool enough? Do you, do you need me to, to get you some different jeans or something? Or she's always like, do you have the, like, you know, we didn't have fancy computers when I was in school, but she's like, do you need like a new pen? Or do you need new binders or anything? Or is your backpack okay? And she always wanted me to feel like I fit in, like I belonged, you know? And my kids are awesome like that and uh yeah i know most of you totally understand what's up mike wood welcome bro i know the demographic range of my viewership and most of you by the numbers most of you are definitely parental age anyway I'll likely have some kids yourselves so yeah she's super cool and every once in a while my mom would literally wake me up and i was a pretty good student too she'd wake me up like an hour before my alarm would go off and like a couple times a year I was looking at my note. No movement shot. Okay. And she say, just turn off your alarm. You don't have to get up. You don't have to go to school today. And uh, and then she'd take me out. We'd like go for lunch. We'd, uh, you know, like she'd maybe take me out shopping and M-O-M. M-O-M. And like, you know, get a new, like new outfit or new shirt or whatever. Like, and, uh, and me too, Dunner. <laughs> But yeah, it was like, you know, she always looking out for me like that. And I I don't know. Oh, man, that was a really good shot here, dude. Oh, that's. That's a good shot. I can do good, too. Come on. Perfect. Anyway, first year after school, mine would still phone every morning to make sure I'm awake and ready for work. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, no. Oh, whatever. The guy just crushed his shot anyway. That was a, not the best note ever. No curl. I don't know. I followed it to a T. <laughs> okay, it's fine. We're still going on pretty well here. Definitely up more than we are down. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's fine. If I'm going to lose on a shootout. I'd rather lose on that shootout to that shot than so many other circumstances. Because uh, that, was, that was good. 
Yo, look how fast I'm getting opponents. Like, what am I doing right? Are you guys, are you other? Like, I know Paul said he was taking sweet time, and Willow was having trouble getting opponents. Anybody else? Is... Maybe Ben Ben got me on the turbocharged plan. Who's the woman with the tattoos and why have I never seen her before? Oh, that's one of Terry's Terry's girlfriends, David. Yeah, I don't think Terry's here, but usually if I talk about his girlfriend, he seems to magically appear. Sometimes that's how it is, right, Rancho? I accept it. It's fine. It's fine. I never once imagined no bank booster. Is it a good deal? I don't even really look at it. Is it bad? Is it good? I can think of much better things to spend my gems on. Like, to me, I think you should get to the point where you just earn the coins because you learn the holes, right? Like, it takes me a while to learn this tour because I don't get enough practice. You know, if I could sit here and play for a few hours a day and, you know, go through those ups and downs uh, faster, then I would get better sooner, right? Like, I just feel like the, the effort is proportionate to the reward. 11, 8, 11, 6. I'm going to give us a little bit of curl, not too much. It's crap. Okay. <laughs> uh, Rian, yes. Yes. And I've, I've, oh no. Oh no, oh no, we're good. I've definitely had this conversation with the chat multiple times on stream and everybody would tell you to spend the few bucks. In fact, I would even go so far as to say, like, consider buying both of the main apps and decide which one you like better through experience. For, you know, if you're the kind of person that's getting really into the game and you're really enjoying it and you're playing a lot, um, I don't know why, Nick. I mean, that's a good thing, I guess. One to one minus point two. There you go. Yeah, I just basically play it one to one almost all the time. Works out pretty good. But yeah, I would say Rion, like it, it's a small price to pay considering how much you know most games cost. And you know, yeah, right, Nick. Like I was, I kind of don't like that. I like I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter. I just hate that they take away the practice tokens if you don't use them. I think that's like the thing I hate about paying for them. Otherwise, it's a, it's fine. It's just like irritating when. You feel like they could be stolen after you've already bought them. So I feel like that's a real, a real scam, you know? I have both and prefer one. Yeah, and I I totally agree, Dunner. I completely and utterly agree. What's up, Nicholas? Welcome, bro. That's my big like beef is this slider. It's a bit difficult, but I, I feel like I know this app so well and I could learn the other one. It's not that big of a deal. I have it on the iPad actually, I think right now. Right, thanks, Rancho. I think, yeah, at the end of the day, like it's still a video game. I mean, I'm, I just worked day three of seven uh, concurrent nursing shifts. So it's like, Caddy seems to be updated more. Okay. Yeah, their development. Oh, oh, sweet. Their development team definitely seems to be more active on social media. Well, for a little while, yeah, Nicholas, I'm going to play some uh, expert in the main tournaments, but I'm still making pro nine hole notes because I'm, I don't know, stubborn and I enjoy it. Oh, we're so close. We're fine. We're just gonna Neo this shot, okay? Out the pin. I have both. Do not use notebook for anything other than needle training. Interesting. Maybe I should, I don't know. Maybe I should learn the other one a little more. I put in all the info first and use the slider last. Yep. That's exactly what I do. So like, let's say the wind here is six, six. I just like hold it. I'm like, all right, 75. Okay, 6.3. Oh, I want 38, 3.2. 
Like, I, I, it's harder to preset it. But I get what you're saying. Check the bounces, baby. Oh, man. I miss that guy. Damn it. I love his stream so much. It does, Willow. 100%. But you got to turn the camera sideways and look at the... Look at the curvature and... You know? And you got to make a lot more noise when you're playing. Bum, 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 bum. They do, Jeffrey. They just need to keep it the same, whatever, but add the number pad that you can just tap it to highlight it. Enter the number pad, you know? Because, like, if I could just tap at the top where it says 50%, tap. And then the, the whole white space in the bottom, hello, could just be another number pad. Boop, boop, boop. And then I could tap, you know, the zero mile, you know, like, or just add it so that we move it down. And then where the slider is, use the same kind of number pad as where the wind goes in and make it have the same, like, look and design or whatever. The wind direction. If I'm playing tour play, Steven, for a headwind shot on a drive or something, or like, yeah, if I, if I, I, I do sometimes, but not really in a tournament shot usually. But sometimes they do. Sometimes. Sometimes I know I've seen shots that do. Um, just depends how you set up the shot. You can set up any shot like any way as long as you kind of keep consistent with it. Um, you know, I could always play with it on in this position and then I would just have to like adjust accordingly, right? Like. So it is fairways and greens, fairways and greens. No craziness. Uh, I think I had like 35th place or something, Dunner. So I'd say mediocre, but fun. I shot a minus 30 on the weekend round. You know, honestly, I hit a few great balls. So they were all very, very likely. And then I had like two or three sit on the edge. I would have won my bracket with all the, those little differences. It's like, that's the fine margins, right? Like, absolutely, Nicholas. There's no question in my mind that is an inevitable outcome. I don't know. I have no idea. I mean, do I play enough to get there? Debatable. Possible, though. I play a lot more people, a lot more than people who don't try. So, I don't know. Look at this guy. Good ball with the Zerk. I feel honored. Honored. Go in the water or something. Yeah, that's what you get. Play a Zerk against me. I appreciate it, Paul. Thank you, buddy. Have the wind arrow turned on might make you over adjust. Yeah. So I'm just going to play this like real ladylike here. That's it. <laughs> Six to twelve. Yeah, hey. Hey, bonjour, Monsieur Simon. Lock a bit, bro. Good. Thank you again, Jeffrey. It's always hilarious to see a 420 from Jeffrey. Missed number three both times. Yeah, it's always those little minor things, right? And I try never to beat myself up about it. I think that's one of the things that's like paramount to the airlift gaming experience it's like to not sweat the small stuff it's what you do consistently right steven yeah it's like what you that's exactly exactly i feel the same way i know you can get there bro but 28 minutes behind welcome back rachel bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. I can get it to the green still. He can still time. Oh no, he lost a shot. That's gonna be good. Nope. <laughs> good effort. Two Zerks against me in tour 10 play after already putting one in the water. Like right down there. No man, you gotta learn from it. Like, I'm down to learn. I screw shit up. I want to learn what I did wrong. Like, I'm not ignorant to the fact that I don't know everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm definitely keen to be educated. Um on my shortcomings 15-7 uh, let's push this Great job. 
60. All right, well, I didn't do 60. I probably should have, but whatever. We're stayed close enough here, and uh, we're technically putting. Okay, that's fine. Ba -ba. Hey, Dr. Vickis Jane. Welcome, bro. Thank you for being here, man. I appreciate you guys. I hope you're having a good day. So far, we're playing okay here. Can't complain. Ba -ba. This current background slide reminds me of the current TikTok trend for some reason. <laughs> I, I, I can't imagine why. I mean, I don't. I, I heard about it anyway. Which is all I know. <laughs> you just made just what made me spit that all over my fancy monitor, Rachel. <laughs> a fr yeah, Willow. Uh, they were writing about it on, uh, on, you know, a blog post I was reading. Yeah. Bum, bum, bum. Oh no! Don't you don't. Okay, I, I meant to do that. I meant to do that. Yeah, Jet, you heard about that? Yeah. No idea. No idea. Love it, Tuck, yes sir. So far, so good. Bum, bum, bum. Well, I attained my little short-term goal faster than I thought I would. I was like, okay, I'm going to get back to 3901, and then I'm going to end my stream. What's up, Mark Crouchy? Welcome, bro. No, no, no Tide Pods for you, bro. Oh, right, Grenson? Yeah. Um, But I feel like just keep going. Welcome, Oper. Thank you for being here, man. Nice to see you, buddy. <laughs> do they ever dude do they ever like insane like insane i've yeah i've seen some people's channels just exploded over a couple of titties in the shadows like it's ridiculous i don't know how desperate people are honestly but it's fun when you can do it on a super popular platform i guess somehow uh tiktok's like moderation system has like i don't know put their blinders on um it, it's mind-boggling to me what trying to watch 8k movie no what are you talking about no 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 if i ever use my monitor it's for gaming uh and streaming of course i currently have three monitors one of them has my notes this one has you you are here thank you for being here i keep my chat right in front of me uh and then my other obs setup i can see my stream and all that and then over there i have um uh, my youtube channel on a browser right i've got chrome am i using chrome right now yeah i am bum, 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 bum. did he really get over i'd have to bring out my apoc i don't have enough curl well i gotta just i'm gonna just go with the hope that this guy doesn't sink this i don't think he will i don't need a massive amount of topspin here or i'll get myself in trouble I know that. Oh, I could technically. I guess when you say that, yeah. I do have two 4K monitors. My main one is a 144 hertz gaming monitor. Just jumping back to your son again. Did you manage to check out the... Oh, it's too much. Those are too much money for me to afford. The ones here... Like I, and the thing is, I don't want to send him. What's up, Tony? Welcome, buddy. I don't want to send him to school with something that he feels like almost uncomfortable carrying as like a, you know, he's still in the grade eight, right? So I don't want to send him to school with like a $2,000 laptop. I'm, I'm aiming for like about a grand, a Canadian. Um, there's like a Dell G series. Um, they have like DDR5 RAM, so good multitasking for them. They have, uh, um, you know, you can customize some things. 
Yeah, when he's going into like university, then yes, I will get him a badass baller one. But right now, I kind of want him just to have something that like it can kind of pass by as not being. Yeah, that's Jeffrey Ajit. That's exactly what I'm looking at. That's right, Dunner. That's exactly right. Mm -hmm. bum, bum, bum. Thank you for trying the dunk, bro. Perfect. Yeah, that, that, I want to get him like a G15. And my work, I can save about $450 off the price of it. So then it becomes much more like reasonable. And yeah, I'm just trying to be a good dad, I guess. I don't know. It's a bit strange, but it's fun. You know, because sometimes I think about myself too much. <laughs> you know, I'm like, I need new lighting. I'm like, do I really? No. It's like, I want it, but my son actually could use it. Oh, that's, that's Nick. Let's go. My daughter got a laptop from school to get to. Oh, yeah. And my school, my son's school will give them, like, you know, stuff like that as well. But. That university, right? I love that gym. Yeah, I love that. And I told his little brother too. I told Johnny, my middle son, he's 11. I said, when you're a teenager, and if you're also continuing to be an excellent student, then I would very much consider doing the same for you. Um, but it's definitely not a guarantee. It's a privilege. John K, welcome, bro. Hey, buddy, have a good leak. Nice to see you. Yeah, that is, look, it's Nick. Nicely done, Tony. Nicely done, bro. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Right, Tom? Yeah, it's like... So... So don't, don't tell my wife. I'm gonna show you, I'll show you what I did. Oh, shootout. Hi, shootout. I was like talking about computers. I got the note. We're good. Oh, it's Nick. Okay, let's go. Come on. Nick, Nick, Nick. We get cross. I gotta push up one ring. Right through the hoop. Nick, Nick, Nick. What are you doing? He's so ridiculous. I'll show you what I did. I took the uh, like the the product picture of it. Oh, did I delete it? Oh, I cleaned up all my screenshots. Their deals are always changing, but it's like it was on a white background. So I edited the photo with my like on my phone, and I just like got rid of the gaming, and I just left the G. So it said like it's like like Dell something G G. <laughs> when am I doing a Fortnite stream? Um on the night of the 11th so if you look on my channel over i have it scheduled so if you want to join bro nice shot i think let's see if i can pull this off we got headwind thank you nick uh yeah let's just push Seven back to right. Ten percent min. Seven two. That's red point two. I push up a ring like I was told. Maybe if I'd listened. No curl. Should get there this time. Um, all of them, Tony. All of them, bro. All of them. My two-year-old has an iPhone 8. My autistic nine-year-old, who's completely non-verbal. Nick, bro. Thank you. He has an iPad that his grandparents bought him. That's like a mini four or something. Um... Then the 11 year old now granted the the phones are all hand-me-downs from my wife and i i don't just buy it outright for the kids i always kind of pass them down we take good care of them um the 11 year old has an i think it's an 11 and i think his brother has the same thing so yeah i think they all need stuff these days Six rings, I guess, from about mid here.
I treated myself to a new one after 11 years. What? Wow. I'm, I'm, I like prioritize technology in my life. I, I'm under the belief that if I spend as many hours of the day as I do on my phone. Yeah, right, Jim. I'm sorry, bro. I don't know. I, it's just something I've always prioritized. I've always been a nerd. I, I, like, I would much rather have a nice phone than, like, you know, whatever, anything. <laughs> you know, like, I, I don't, I don't care about my my yard. Like, I, I have a basic yard. I don't care about buying clothes at all. I don't care about my shoes. Like, my mom or my wife forces me to buy shoes. It's just how I am. I just, I'm, I'm happily simple in all aspects of my life. And then the digital aspect, I like it to be like, I'll save up for it for months to find something, to get something I really want. And I always like withdraw the money so my wife doesn't spend it. I keep it in cash until I'm ready to do whatever it is. So I've learned a lot of willpower that way over the years. I get my kids hand me down phone. <laughs> I hope that'll be me one day, Jim. I really believe I'll be that grandpa in my hospital you know, and my my boys, they damn well better get me a iPhone 29 or whatever. Because I have hooked their little butts up for years. I love that. I really have. I'm just a digital parent. I see the value in it. And I talk to so many parents at work. Like, I'm a nurse, right? So I talk to women about parenting pretty often and they think I'm a batshit crazy. Like they think I'm nuts. And then I look at my oldest with all his access to information and how he does so damn good in school. And I'm like, how would he do that if he only had one hour of screen time a day? Like, and what, what kind of hypocrite am I? My iPhone screen time usage and I work full time. I do this like here, I got nothing to hide. I did. Oh, John, I used to have sick Phoenix Gold subs in my car. Have a great night, buddy. I had the 12-inch sub. Look at six hours and 41 minute daily average. It's been higher before. I've had that as high as like eight, nine. I'm just, it's just, it's just how I am. It's a wonder I'm on YouTube sitting in front of a computer every night. Kind of works out, you know. Yeah, I know the chip. I'm down. I think at the World Economic Forum, they actually had a video recently kind of like um, sort of like hypothesizing what it would be like to be a worker in a business that had like um, implantable chain ch uh, chips in people's brains, chains, that's chips and brains. Um, well, on my phone, Tony, my phone, you know, on here, five minutes off there, you know. I don't either, Tom. I, I, I literally don't. Wef, what is that? Is that is that like WAP? Nick's got the tricks. Boom. The tricks. That's how I feel, Jim. Yep. Yep, they do. My kids read books. They have friends and go out they're not really into many sports oh world economic fund oh i believe you i i have no doubt about it i have no doubt about it okay what kind of win okay cross headwind mid 20 mid 20 <laughs> nick nick's like i'll get one of these one day more likely in your arm well some companies are definitely working towards the brain implants. I guess other physical body implants. I'm like sizing up my shot and Nick's like, I'm going to dunk it. He's just trying to be nice and he is. Thank you very much. Helping uh, keep my coin balance up, I guess, for the uh, tournament. I'll be playing expert if any of you are interested. I've, a phone I've had for a little over two years. Only taken one picture. What? One picture? Tony, do you want to talk about it, bro? Is everything okay?
20 mid circle drop op 12 8 camera in modern day phones oh they're very remarkable let's go let's go i'm sure nix was just about that close there's a pic i posted on facebook <laughs> right david i'm like what is wrong are you depressed tony we love you bro you can come and talk anytime i i literally like i, I take pictures all the time all the time screenshots and pictures like, don't we all? And that doesn't even go back that far. I've got, oh, actually, I've got 9,585 photos, which is not that many compared to some of the, uh, the mums that I work with. 15 a month for one line. That sounds pretty good. Did I? I might have. Yeah, I think I might have. Oh, let's go. I might have. I try to give a lot of support. I do. And I find a lot of cool pictures. I have like 2,000 friends on Facebook through this amazing community. And, uh, you know, lots of cool stuff you see that way. I like my Facebook um, account being kind of open like that, if you will. I, at first, I didn't think I would. Um, I've been on Facebook like since it first launched. Good luck, brother. And so I was like, I don't know. I want to keep it just my friends and family. And now I've realized like, no, I don't. Half of them are annoying. I mean, I love you guys. Uh, seven rings here. That's true, Nicholas. It really is. Now we're talking, Tony. Oh, let's go. Try zero. I, I kept a landline for a really long time. I feel like I was one of the like last holdouts of all the people I know. Um, and I used to say one of the main reasons was that so that my kids could call 911 until I realized they didn't even need to have a cell plan to call 911 on their cell phones that they all have. So I couldn't think of any other reason to keep one. Slows down five gigs. Do you want to talk about that, Jeffrey? <laughs> that's, I mean, that's actually not bad. I think that's actually, I don't really know. I have unlimited data, but I, I definitely don't think I actually use that much. I think there's a way to look, but I don't really know how. Cellular. Current period. Yeah, 238 gigab. <laughs> okay, I've used 238, 237 gigabytes in my current billing period. Does that mean I have a problem or? Two point five gigs a day. Yeah, so I'm a digital child, okay? Uh. Great shot. Oh, and Canada apparently has some of the like most expensive like nice won't get me through tonight, right? Like Yeah. I mean I'm not entirely proud of being a complete nerd, but I'm not gonna sit here and represent myself as something I'm not. Uh, you know. <laughs> like it's all in good fun. Ba, ba, ba. Come on, drop this one, Nick. Do it. Show us this, this shot. Come on. Drop it. Hey, give it 110%. Drop this shot. Show me the way. I believe. Unlimited calls and broadband usage. That's good. Yeah. You, really, Jeffrey? Come on now. Live a little, bro. Well, the thing is, for me, like, I, I literally, I, I, the hospital that I work at, the Wi Fi is so bad. That I always just use my like data all day. What's up, yes, B? Welcome, bro. Thank you for being here, man. I always just use my um 
data anyway. And like my job is funny like that. Like there's several hours in a row where I don't even have a second to look at it. And then I have time where I have like a couple hours and like, you know, I can chill for a little bit. So I kind of, you know, play on my phone, right? Like I talk to my colleagues and stuff, but it's like, they're all sitting there. You know, you got six nurses who have no call bells and their charting's done. What do we do? Do we talk to each other? No, not anymore. We all just stare at our phones. It's like, that's how we socialize. Ba, 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 ba. It's like the most algorithmically difficult putt possible. Well executed. Okay, it's good. The 420s. Thank you, Mr. Nick. A little, little bufferage of the uh, end outcome here. Oh, which hole is this? I still love being able to practice these shootout shots. I have Wi-Fi everywhere. I just make sure I'm paying here. Oh, that works. There you go. Okay. <laughs> no, po no political. No, no, no. We're good. Oh, I think that's... Who's he with? Yeah, Kobe's there. Dream team. That's pretty damn cheap. 36 per... Is that a year? <coughs> or is an anim a month? I have no idea what an anim is. Must be per month. Is that a month? Nice shot, bro. That was good. No move here for me. Correct tailwind. 3.5 back, one left. Twelve five. It's 12.5, one to one. And I can hear Nick. I can hear him. He's saying, come on, bro. Drop this. I can hear him. Oh, <laughs> get out of here. Oh, you're ridiculous. Thank you, bro. A year, 36 a year. What? Welcome, Steven Stokes. Nice to see you, bro. What? 36 a year? Yes, Jen. Yes, yes, sir. Hey, what's up, champ? Welcome, bro. Thank you, buddy. Yes, I did. I got that, too. Thanks for the games, Nick. Thank you very much, man. Yeah, I did. Look at that. We got the EB7, Thor 7. Got my Epoch 6. And then I changed my Patreon account so that I can uh, uh, so that I can download expert notes for the next full tournament. And I'll still make my pro notes in the nine hole. Uh, should be able to see here. I... Oh, not available. Okay, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Never mind. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. Oh, in India. That's amazing. Welcome, TLC. Welcome, bro. Where are you going, Tim? Much better. Okay. Okay. Let's check that out. Let's absolutely check that out. That's a good idea. You know, I mirrored my phone to my parents' TV one year to watch that movie, The Dictator, at Christmas. My computer. <laughs> yeah, champ. Come on now. We got to keep it fresh around here a little bit, right? Let's watch Nick's. Is that really a sticky spot? But whatever. I see where you are. See that? Yeah. Oh, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got it first. Go, Stephen Stokes. How how is that complicated? What do they call you, Stokes? <laughs> what, what oh, it didn't work, Tony. You have to get a um, um, a capture card, bro. I'll show you. 
Let, let me literally show you. One second. I'll show you. I have one right here. Like, like literally one minute. All right, so oh, let me make my no, that's fine. I'll show you here. Look, so you have like your device to connect to your device, right? So it plugs into my phone and that's the HDMI cable that goes into this little adapter and the HDMI cable connects to a little oh, screen. It's, it's a capture device. Okay. And that interfaces with your computer. So you can't just plug directly from the device into the computer. You need a device. Yeah, you need a capture card. And they're cheap. You can get a cheap like 4K one on Amazon uh, that'll actually work perfectly good. And especially if you're using a phone or a tablet, make sure you check the resolution. Because if it's bigger, yeah, Elgato, bro. I have the built-in. I have the... Um, Game Capture 4K 60 Pro in my computer. Welcome in, Preppy. How much are those? That one I showed you was really expensive, but it was given to me for free by, um, I'll show you, Supercell. You know the company, uh, I'm gonna turn my green screen filter off for a second. I wanna show you. I'm really like proud of this thing. Uh, my face cam, filters, chroma key. Hi there. So if you look, there there's a logo uh supercell that's it was gifted to me by them which i'm uh very pleased by i've got to call the nine hole off i can't get the green greens right oh no worries bro well send them a message tim they might set you up bro give, give them a little message to support you'd be surprised yeah clash of clans and clash royale Best Buy, probably. I'll show you what I would buy uh, on Amazon for how cheap they are. Like, literally. Here. Look at this first one here. I hope you can see it. It's like 4K video capture, $39. You know, 24 20 bucks these will all work you know just for just for capturing you know your your basic gameplay on your input just set it to hdmi and you just run your hdmi yeah let's play some more rounds some more holes thank you nick look at that just because nick boosted me a little bit i've been playing well Four thousand trophies how many tokens do i have i have no idea uh I suppose if I went into it, I could find out. Yeah, yeah. It, get get the 4K one because um, so for example, like I used to always have trouble with my capture on my stream. Lots of my old viewers here can confirm. Just look up 4K capture card, capture card. And that should be able to get your signal from your device into your computer and i reckon the tv i would confirm that i've never tried using a tv for it but i'm pretty sure it'll work for the direct hdmi input how do you make switching scenes animate oh yeah it's just um it's called a a stinger transition or just a transition in general so i actually went on fiverr.com and i had somebody make it for me yeah, maybe so risky on a, a smart TV. Yeah, I get that. I get that. I thought I entered it. Six, seven. There we go. Take care, David. Much love, bro. I'm actually going to. I'm gonna quit at the top here now. Yeah, a little scene transition. So I actually have four different stinger transitions. I don't have them all properly set up right now. Um, 
Oh, no, I think I took away the one that was actually working. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Does that record? No. No, so that's why I use the computer, right? I connect. I have a capture card built directly into my computer. And so I'm using OBS to stream. You could also use it to record. But if you just want to do it on the TV, I don't know. I would use Open Broadcaster Software, OBS. It's free. It's open source. It's like, like, like the de facto, like, like industry standard, like streaming software, but also for video recording and all that. It's uh, it's a good, good idea. Yeah, I can't believe. I was hoping to get to 3901. I, uh, I definitely did some good wins on my own and then a little help from a friend. And uh, yeah, 4K. I'm going to leave it there so that maybe over the next week, I might actually get a few Apox show up in the store. If we're lucky, ooh, maybe we can get a little something here. Bum, bum, bum. And maybe tomorrow, right? I don't know. I don't even care. I just would like to see it. It would be a first for me. I've never been over 4,000 trophies. There we go. Uh, no app required to mirror. I have no idea. Maybe. If you have the right kind of TV, you need a smart TV. Oh, Thor for sure. It's not even... Uh, Sahara? I mean, there's only six. Flappy would say Sahara. I mean, right? I mean... Come on. Come on. Come on, Mjolnir. Let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. That's how we do things around here. Guys, thank you so much for the incredible, incredible generosity tonight. I don't even know how to thank you enough for being so supportive and so kind. It's just, it makes, it just makes this experience like icing on the top. I would sit here and play by myself but the fact that i can hang out with you makes it so much better so check the channel i got streams pre-scheduled 50 days in advance i got red dead coming up we got fortnite we got more tour play streams and of course the tournament i got videos up for the nine hole check it out we will be live once again in two nights for now playing the nine hole qualifier and uh making notes together so i hope to see you then Check out airlightgaming.com for free notes. Have a beautiful day. Thank you for the love and the positivity. Now go call your mama.